Hey, everybody, back again with a college football free play with analysis. Rob Vino here to take you through the Houston and Cincinnati game. Houston at Cincinnati, uh, now a Big 12 matchup. And I think there's a, a significant advantage here that we can play. So we're going to get to all of that. But before I do, let me just go ahead and let you folks know about a college football season long special currently being offered by Wager Talk 249. Get you the rest of the entire season here. In the case um, of myself, nine unit profit last week, um, strong week, and it kind of follows up a pattern that I followed here last year. The final 15 weeks of the season, the first couple were a little dicey, but the final 15 weeks, and you'll get 16 weeks out of this package right through the national championship game, we picked up 48 units worth of profit. So certainly once I've seen a couple weeks of college football, put that knowledge to use. It got clients paid last year. It'll get you paid this year. And once again, just $249 for 16 more weeks of college football action. Excellent special price from Wager Talks. You can go ahead and find that on my homepage at wt.buzz slash RV. Once again, college football remainder of the season off of a hot week last week where we picked up nine units, uh, wagertalk.com. Let's get to this Houston and Cincinnati game here. Um, Big 12 conference affair. Last year, Cincinnati won this game. So a little atonement here for the Houston Cougars, if you um, like that sort of thing. But it's been a change of head coaches with Willie Fritz taking over now for Houston. So I don't know how much that exists. But I would say there's plenty of ammunition available to make a case for firing on the road underdog Houston Cougars here. The new head coach, as I mentioned, Willie Fritz, and his defensive coordinator, Shaw Wood, have the Cougars defense playing dominant fashion football right now. Um, over their last two games, these are some numbers you want to write down. Over the last two games, the Houston Cougars have faced Oklahoma and Rice. They played Oklahoma in Norman. Houston's defense has faced 24 true possessions. In other words, there were no kneel downs. There were true possessions. There was no halftime kneel down, no game-ending kneel down. But against the 24 possessions that they faced, in the last two weeks, 20 of those 24 have traveled 19 yards or less. Only three of those 24 drives have averaged more than 3.8 yards per play. Only two of the 24 reached the red zone. It's incredible how good this Houston defense has been the last two weeks. The run defense allowed just 166 yards on 53 carries, 3.1 per carry in those games. They rank number 14 right now in the nation in total defense, probably a little under the radar fact. Cincinnati is just not in that same defensive class right now. They're 116th in total defense. They give up 439 yards per game, six and a half per play. Their pass defense is being shredded for over 300 yards per game right now. And Miami of Ohio, led by Brett Gabbert last week, had 356 passing yards Against this Cincinnati defense, five Miami of Ohio drives reached the Cincinnati 21 or deeper. They had a couple of turnovers inside the red zone, which hurt them. They also fumbled on their own three-yard line that led to a three-yard Cincinnati touchdown drive that hurt Miami. Otherwise, that result could have been a little bit different. The strength of schedule favors Houston here. Houston's already played UNLV, who is playing beyond expectations. They've played Oklahoma. They've played Rice. Cincinnati's played Towson State. Miami of Ohio and Pittsburgh. I think in this case, you have the better, the superior defense. I'll put it that way. You've got quick strike touchdown ability. Houston has scored five touchdowns in the last two weeks of 37 yards or better, and they're all mixed rushing touchdown, passing touchdown, punt return, special teams touchdown. So five of over 37 yards in the last two weeks gives them quick strike ability. I think all of these things added up here leads to a solid stance with the visiting Cougars. The number's been pushed down from five to three and a half, but getting more than a field goal, still well worth it. So my look here as the free play for this video is the Houston Cougars plus three and a half. On the way out, I ask everybody to hit the like button. Go ahead and hit the like button. Let us know your thoughts on this game. Drop a comment on any other game that you're uh, looking at playing this weekend. I try to answer them all as quickly as I can. Click subscribe. Join the near 170,000 people that already have subscribed to Wager Talk TV. Good luck with all your plays this weekend. Let's cash this one. I'll see you soon with my next selection and analysis right here on Wager Talk TV.